standard 7 english lesson 1 odd one in how was the first day of the school asked mother as reema sat down for dinner okay reema start no lesson just settling in any new girl in your class inquired her father mr seal only one malati and she is funny grims reema as she helped herself to the salad why do you say that asked mr c she can't speak much english she has come from another state sniffed reema naming one at the another end of the country <coughs> Oh, children from that state are supposed to be clever. They are specially good at math," said Mr. Singh quietly. "Well, this one does not seem smarter at all. Oily hair, bindi, and all. Good morning, teacher," mimicked Rima. Her parents exchanged glances. Rima was their only child. They doted on her. but she could not be insufferable at times i do hope you and your friends will not make things too difficult for malati signed mr singh as he rose from the table reema and her gang had decided to do just that next morning the minute malati entered the class they all coursed Good morning. Next morning, poor Malti, she did not not realize that they were making fun of her. She beamed back at them and replied, "Good morning." Shenas giggled. "Why do you put so much oil on your hair?" she asked rudely. Malti looked offended, but. did not reply <coughs> and the shirt so lo- so long said claire catchily malti flushed she was about to say something when teacher entered as the class progressed everyone was surprised to see malti raise her hand whenever teacher asked a question yes malti you answer said the teacher Malti answered correctly and the teacher nodded in appreciation. When Reema encountered this at home her mother said sounds like clay worker. What is the use said Reema uncharted. Her English is so atrocious. The same may be said for your Hindi countered Mr Singh sharply. He was getting quite sick of Reema's attitude. Even Mr. Singh did not like it. That night, Rima's parents decided discuss the matter. We put Lima into a good school to make her smart and confident. I am afraid she is turning into quite snob," said Mr. Singh sadly. The following Saturday was the inter-house singing competition. Rima. who was participating in english song category was surprised to see malti's name in the list of participating for the hindi song category holy play sing also she said crook evening giggle glam they were to be proved wrong malti sang beautifully she had melodious and well trained voice reema and her gang had decided to cheer when malti sang but there was a such absolute silence that they did not dare to do they were sure to be caught when malti finished the principal was the first to start clapping following by the teacher and students no one was surprised when malti won first prize as the term progressed it was abundantly clear that all that malti was a bright child she was quite studious and intelligent 
she fared well in sports as well as in studies her front was mathematics her simple ap- appearance belied a sharp and nimble brain slowly many of the girls began seeking her help in mathematics help which she readily and cheerfully gave the teacher had liked the respectful intelligent girl from the beginning now the girls from the class also befriended her not reema and her click do they stubbornly dislike malti they were a stylish lot and nothing that malti did could alter the fact that she was not their type they never lost chance to poke fun at her particularly her english malti felt bad about their behavior one day she was on the verge of tears when reema mocked at her misleasingly because she said ask instead of ask her voice trembling malti said i know my english is weak yours is good please will you help me to improve it i won't be able to help you my dear replied reema with an exalted accent speaking proper english isn't easy for you country field type malti's face turned red she wanted to retort but could not find the right words she burst into tears and ran off that was horrid reema said shenas yes agreed neha and claire roundly reema was shocked her own friends had turned against her she walked off in a huff mrs saint found her soothed over a lunch but decided not to ask anything reema knew that she had behaved very badly she was too proud to admit it even to herself